affectionately known as RR. Robert Roger Brown was the charismatic founder whose life and mission is embedded in the core of the Christian and Missionary Alliance and of Christ Community Church. Dr. Brown was dynamic, hardworking, and deeply committed to Jesus. He was born in 1885 to humble Scottish parents in a small Pennsylvania town. As a part of a large family living in the rough conditions of a coal mining town, R.R. developed a strong work ethic at an early age, and his traits continued to be a distinguishing feature of his life and ministry. A talented athlete and musician, his early desire was to become an actor. But Brown's interests shifted at the age of 18 when he turned his life over to Jesus Christ and devoted all of his talents to serving God. He entered Nyack Missionary College for training in 1910 and after graduation began his first pastorate in Beaver Falls, Pennsylvania, where he met his wife, Mary. In his early years of ministry, Dr. Brown often worked with Dr. A.B. Simpson, founder of the Alliance. Despite the difference in age, Simpson had a significant influence on Brown, evident in his passion for reaching people locally and all around the world with the gospel of Jesus. From Pennsylvania, the Browns moved to Chicago, where he was appointed the superintendent of the Western District of the Alliance and founded the church that A.W. Tozer would later lead. One year later, Brown began services in an old abandoned church in Omaha. His pioneering spirit drew him to the open spaces and warm people of Nebraska. He often referred to Omaha as the heart of America. He conducted four months of nightly tent meetings at 20th and Douglas, and soon 500 people were attending the meetings. In April of 1923, RR was asked to give a religious program on the new radio station, WOW. Most people considered radio to be a gimmick. However, RR envisioned the potential to reach others with the gospel and enthusiastically began what would become 40 years of continuous Sunday radio services. The outreach of the broadcast was heard over much of the Midwest and reached 500,000 listeners at its peak. As a result of the radio outreach, Dr. Brown founded the Okoboji Lakes Bible Conference and was propelled into a regional and national recognition as the voice of the Alliance. Brown was an outstanding preacher possessing great humor and storytelling ability. He loved Jesus and he loved people. To him, the masses across the world were desperately in need, lost and hopeless without Christ. He frequently visited the Alliance mission fields to keep in touch with the work and encourage the missionaries. At home, he utilized any and every means to reach the lost, whether visiting the sick, speaking at a local civic meeting, or inviting visitors at a nearby hotel to attend services. The Spirit of God flowed through his preaching and prayer for others, bringing life change to those that came under his ministry. Not by might, nor by power, but by my Spirit, says the Lord of hosts, Zechariah 4.6. This verse was placed prominently at the front of the church for years and exemplified the life of Robert Roger Brown. In CCC's 100th year, we honor Dr. Brown, his obedience to his calling and his faithfulness to remain steadfast throughout his ministry. We thank God for his goodness throughout 100 years of ministry and blessing us with much more than we could have ever asked or imagined and we step forward into the next 100 years with great confidence, not in our own strength or abilities, but by the strength and power of the Holy Spirit. To God be the glory, amen.